Oh, what did I just get? I got a guitar. Oh, it doesn't do that much, but look at this. Oh my God, it's a guitar. Hi guys, and welcome back for some more Drake Hollow. And today we are going to be working on connecting some supply lines. Now I have taken some time to figure this out. It was a little bit confusing for me, but I did figure it out. You can see we've got one connected already. You can literally see the metal being transferred. I'll show you guys how I did this. We got plenty more to, to be doing, but I spent a long time. This is actually my second time recording because the first time recording, I, I spent way too much time trying to figure it out. So editing was just like, yeah, I think I need to do this over once I fully understand. But you can see we have a line with the metal stuff is coming across. And if I hit tab, you can see it's literally being deposited right into our uh, inventory here. It comes right in. So you can only have one supply line of each type at a time. So that means if I have two trucks that have cans, I can only connect one at a time. Uh, I believe I will be able to, to do, it might be one all together. I'm not even sure, but we're going to figure this. We're going to, we're going to fully figure this out, but we got one going. I'll show you what I did. I did just get a raid and I did make a third bed. That's all I did. Um, so you can double jump to get onto this thing, but you gotta be facing in the direction you wanna go to start. So double jump to get on it. You can ride this, this is a good transport uh, way for you. It will take you literally all the way across. So I don't have to worry about any aether um, shards being needed here. Uh, I did die trying to connect this. As you can see, one of the points was inside that watery whatever stuff. So it's, it is a bit tricky trying to place. They don't, it wouldn't reach. So I had this point here and that point on the other land. It wouldn't reach across. So I had to put one in between to get it to go. Um, so it just was, I don't know if it's the haze uh, or what, but that short distance would not work for me. And you could see that this, this one right here, whoopsie, I got too close to the ladder. You can see this waypoint here to that one in the center is a lot longer than the one from the center. Well, I guess it's about the same. I guess, boy, that's about directly in. Anyways, you get the point. You're gonna have to place waypoints inside this stuff. It does clear a small circle for you to get time to get the aether to clear, but it's a bit tricky. You may die. I did die several times trying to figure this out. So I did just do that one, this one truck. So it took for me in order to connect it to my base, as you can see, it did take five. We've got one, two, three, four, five. And these seem close together. I'll show you what, what the problem there is. Let's jump on this. We'll go back. I'll show you. These are one good shot straight. No, you don't have to worry about any hills. You can see this right here, we're gonna jump off here, is goes up in a hill. So you have to pay attention. This is as low as you want this to go. Otherwise, if I were to scoot this waypoint back any further, I wouldn't be able to connect it to that waypoint. I could connect it to the other one over there, but not to this one, as you can see. You have to be able to, when you hold to interact, you have to be able to see the other one and you can't if it's too far. So this is as tight as I could get it without making more. And obviously when it, I did put this down, you have another hill I couldn't reach at this point to this because this is on a hill. So I just had to go up here to this little hill here where I could see it from here and connect it that way. That might sound a bit confusing, but we are gonna go, we're gonna go over to this, this uh, here. I did, there was some infestation. It does come back. I had like five infestation I had to clear and I cleared all the bad guys. So we're gonna go over here. We're gonna try connect a different supply truck. I do have a few waypoints. I only have one, actually skip that. I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to go farm. I'm gonna have to go farm and uh, get more shards. It is gonna take you a little bit of time to 
farm things and get some glowstone shards to make these waypoints. Obviously, the further out you go, the more waypoints you are gonna need. You can connect the supply trucks to supply trucks, and I think that will count. I have not tried that yet. I don't know if each truck has to be on their own line. That's what I hope to figure out here in a few minutes. It might be each truck needs their own line. I don't know if truck to truck can merge, but we're gonna we're gonna find out. So, uh, so we're gonna go right over here and see if I can make. Well, I only got one waypoint, so I can't make any. Can't make any more. I'm gonna have to go, and I don't think there's any more bad guys over here because I literally just cleared this. So we're actually. If I go over here, I discover this Drake. I think that's gonna give me XP. It might level my camp. My uh, camp status, uh, see, we're close. We only need six more budget. I think if I go over and get this Drake, it's gonna level me up. Now, that's not a problem, except that if I get a raid, it's gonna be quite, it's gonna be harder. <laughs> but you know what, I think I actually I am. I think we'll just go over here, get the Drake, and hopefully kill some bad things and get and get some uh, more shards. So we need to clear this. Uh, okay, so we'll go right over to this way. We got some cattails. I have been using this and selling this. Also, oh shoot. Well, we got the bow. So they do, res they do respawn fairly quickly. And he's gone. Knock it out of the park. So we got one shard. I can make another glowstone, I think, or uh, waypoint. We can make it more healing salve. Okay, so we've got two waypoints. We need to go over here. Um, actually, I'm gonna go up this hill. And we're gonna have to go clear. I don't two waypoints. Two waypoints is not gonna be enough to connect my trucks from over here to, to here. Because this is also inside. So even if I could connect truck to truck, we actually have to go out and around this way. I'm wondering though if I could make a straight line for this here. I bet I could. So this has, each shard has three points. We are only using one here. I bet I could connect from here to here. Okay, so this brick, we're here. How close are we? Is that in direct line? It's not. Trying to see which one will be the next one that would be the closest. It might be this fabric one right here. Okay, no, right down there is a truck. Right down there is a truck. Okay, I think we could probably make a point. I bet I could connect that to a waypoint over there. So what we're gonna do is get on this to clear. We're gonna put, we're gonna use this first of all. We're gonna go over. I know I said I was gonna go get that little Drake, but now that I'm doing this, I'm just gonna do this one real quick to see if it works. Okay, we got another bad guy. Uh, I also have a glow star shard there. Okay, uh, so we just have to have, a, maybe if I can put, I bet I can, if I put a waypoint, I may get away with just being able to put one right here. Okay, so then you come up here and you hit this and connect. Okay, it is just far enough, so that means I'm gonna have to have one in the middle. Can I connect? I can connect to this one, however. So we are gonna have to, this is where it's gonna get tricky and I probably will die, but I have to go in the center or maybe I can go across. You know what, let's just go. Let's uh, clear us a path. Okay, and run. We'll put one right about here. And
Okay, so wait a minute. It gives you time. You can hold. Actually, I probably didn't even need to do that. Dang it. Probably didn't even need to. Yeah, it works that way. Because I'm not going to get a chance. That's fine. I don't need it now. Okay, so I did waste it. Anyway, <laughs> so we have this one connected to the truck. Now we can connect this one to this one. So if we look on our maps. We now have this truck connected to this to this. I think it will carry. I think it will take the... Yep, there it goes. Because that one that's on that island should be depleted already. Wait, let's go in here. My inventory, go to bag. Yeah, we have 33, 33 junk. Let's see. Oops, I'm not facing the right way. This one is 20. This one's only 20. You can see that that junk or the metal scraps is moving across the supply line here. And then... I'm gonna jump off here just because I wanna see if this truck is depleted. I think this is probably depleted. Yeah, this one is depleted. So I could probably undo this one, I wonder. But I'm still gonna need that. So I'm actually gonna leave it up as a way of mobility for right now. But you can see, and then you can switch directions. Left control is the reverse to turn you around. It gets, it does take a little bit of time. It does take a little bit of time getting used to it. <laughs> so we're gonna go over here. I do need to get more shards, however. We do have some uh, plants over here to collect. Okay, so that one's that. So we're gonna have a ton of junk. <laughs> we're gonna, or metal. I don't know why I keep, I think tin cans, I think of junk. Okay, we're gonna go over here and get this little drake real quick and uh, see and discover this. Now, this is an infestation level of 20. I should be getting some shards from that. I should be able to get some shards from it to make some more waypoints because I, I don't have, I need two shards to make a waypoint. So you do need to uh, clear and farm and all that good stuff. But I did use a separate line. I didn't, you can connect from truck to truck. Like I could connect this truck to that truck if I wanted to. Um, is that, yep, that is. I was like, is that a dog? Is that the fang? Yep, it was the fang. Yeah, I've let those things blow up. Okay, so now I need to, we're gonna go over here. Get this poor little guy stranded. And stranded he is. Let's quickly switch to our healing salves because I'm sure I'm gonna get jumped. Uh, let's get rid of this stuff while we're here. Okay, we're gonna take a hit to... We have like three seconds, four seconds I think it is to get out of that water. <sighs> okay, uh, we gotta get some of this. Okay, there, there's that little drakey. I see the... Uh, Wake the drake. And we have incoming. Okay. Let him go back. Cancel. Okay. Listen. Okay. So he's hidden. We have to hold Hooser. Player's health increased. I think we just leveled up, didn't we? Nope, zero charms collected. We already, we have to heal him though. He'll go back to camp. He did get hit. Um, we can give him a crystal. Let's go ahead and give him one of those. There we go. There you go, go. Little guy, go on your way. Go back to camp. I will have to make another bed. We'll have to make another bed. There he goes. So that just, we didn't, I thought maybe we would level up, but uh, let's look at our camp. We're close. Also says that we have no food and water 
And no seeds. Jeez, oh Pete, my... Did they eat it all already? Okay, whatever. I'm gonna clear this, though, before going back. And... Then... I'm not gonna waste that. Listen. We're also gonna get this wood. There we go. Now this map does not have, I believe this one does not have any supply. Oh, it has one wood supply truck on here. I didn't think there was any. Those fangs are, I didn't notice it the first time I killed them. They're a pain in the ass. Cause they not only do that, where it nearly kills you. It, uh, they spit out, if you're far from them, they will spit out the grunts. That's a grunt. Which, they're fine to kill, they're easy, but when you get four or five of them, suddenly they're not so easy. We'll go ahead and heal ourselves. We got our chest up here. That'll give us some blunder bus. Ooh, I got a t-shirt! Octopus t-shirt! What? Let's take a look at our beautiful shirt. Oh, that's actually kind of cute. I actually will wear that. Okay, we got, this is a cache, so we just got some electrical. So we now have, we now have 16 of those, which is awesome. Oh, what did I just get? I got a guitar. Oh, it doesn't do that much, but look at this. Oh my God, it's a guitar. <gasps> That's so cool. It only does 28, 28, six average damage. Base damage is 27. Critical hit is 15. That is pretty high. That is pretty high compared to anything else I've got. We're gonna go with that. Yeah, we're gonna go with this for right now. We got ourselves a freaking guitar. I do have a couple drakes that are ready to level up. I'm sure that will help level the camp too once I, I get them grown up. Island is clear. Might as well get the wood. Oh, we got another backpack. Apparently, we got another backpack. This one. Oh, here's another one. When did I get that? Yo, I've got, I've, when did I get these? I don't even know when I got these backpacks. What? I don't even know where these came from. Like, I didn't have this one before. I had this one, and then I had these two, I think. I don't remember having this one. I like this blue one, though. I'm gonna keep this one. I can get in a raid in nine minutes. I'm gonna go back to my camp. I'm gonna teleport back, and we're gonna see how many, we're gonna see how much we level up, if we can level up with uh, aging up a uh, drake. I know I have one that's ready to be aged up, but I didn't wanna do it just yet. So I'm gonna use a one of these. Okay, it looks like I got a couple presents here too. So let's, this is our new little guy. Thank you, and give the gift, obtain the gift. What'd you give us? Aw, shiny spoon. And I don't have anything for you. Come here, little pleep pleep. Where are you running to? Get the gift. He gave us some blunder blast shots. Nice, two of them. Oh, we can give a crystal to him. So he's close to adolescent, but he's not gonna level up. There's your little shard. Okay, where's my other guys? I know one of them. Is this the new one? That's the new guy. I know, let's put our drink stuff in here. I know we have one of these guys that's gonna level. Yeah, this one maybe? Yep, this one. Age Drake up. And there he is, aged up. I think it might level us. Oh no, it didn't level us. Okay, so he's, oh, yep, there we go. Camp leveled up. 
So level three, we get to do the advanced curio thing. This is the one that we want. Advanced curio. Okay, so we have four schematics. So we'll be able to unlock most of them. So we unlocked that. Uh, what is this one? Bunk beds. Okay, we're gonna leave it for just a second. I wanna make sure I get the real, real important things. Here's the pinball machine and the drinking water. We want the defenses. And let's see, we want power. Okay. So I think we can unlock everything. Yeah. So we'll come back up here to bunk, bunk beds and unlock that. We have enough to unlock them all. There we go, we have unlocked all of our stuff. So we have it needs, it takes eight circuitry, 50 charms, scrap metal and lumber. We have enough to make that, but I really want the advanced workshop. Okay, we need two fabric. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go buy it because I only need two. Okay, so this is, this is the thing. It needs room. Uh, let's put this. I am gonna build a fence all the way around. There we go. Power and water. Some improvements need power or water in order to function. This needs power. So we have to build ourselves a treadmill. It does need to be... I'm going to wait till I get this raid, I think, because I don't want them damaging it. We're going to need another, another raid. I also think I need to put fences up. Like... Where's my defense? If I put maybe out to here. Here. Whoop. I will eventually get used to the <laughs> rotating. Okay, we gotta, we gotta fight. See, they'll go for the fence, which does stop them. Oh, what did I do? Shoot his toes? Okay, where's the other one? How about you go after the beds? How about that? You can go after the bed. Go after the beds. Okay, he is going after the uh, fence now. Or he's going after my guy. Uh, We did just get... Nails. This is why you want defenses. Cause they hit your stuff. Yo, oh, I got a pink hoodie. What? What? I got a pink hoodie. Oh, it's glorious. Oh, it's nice. Okay, anyways. All right, so we're good on that raid. We need to, first thing we need to do is get more fences up. We need to get fences up here. And yeah, quick here. Really quick. Because the raid, as we level up, our camp levels up, we get, we're going to get more, they're going to get harder. Probably didn't need to come out this far with the fence. <laughs> Uh, probably didn't need to, but you know, I just want some protection because I don't want them wrecking up water and shit. What does it take for the power, the treadmill? What does it take for that treadmill? 
Uh, we need four lumber. Well, I'm gonna go chop down some trees. Actually, you know what I think I'm gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and end this episode here. The next time we get together, I'll just sit here and farm, and then the next video we will, uh, connect all this stuff and get some more supply lines going here. This has so many trucks on it I need to connect. So hopefully we get that all connected. We've got a start on it. We've got at least some fencing come that's up. I just need to come further, right? We're almost actually, we don't need that much more, but I need to farm some wood and I need to get that power going because as you can see, their food and water is quickly diminishing because I need power, yo. I need some power. Ain't got nothing to add to that. Uh, so we'll figure this out the next time. So if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't yet subscribed, it would be amazing if you did. And don't forget to click the little bell to get notified whenever I have a video go up. And I hope you all have a great rest of your day. And I will see you in the next video. Mm, bye.